Okay, we're in the continuation of our project. Um, okay, we have our uh, battery charger, and this is 72 volts. And we, over there, you can see where we've cut through here, uh, getting everything ready to the wire. That's one of our cables. Uh, we're going to figure out some kind of mounting mechanism uh, for a uh, for power inlet. Uh, right now, that's just one of those uh, six way strips. For the moment. Alright, we're going to be hooking up our pack tracker, our motor leads to our, uh, okay, we're going to be running our motor leads and our uh, leads for our pack tracker through the holes we've cut into the side of the box. And down here is our uh, new placement for our motor controller. And uh, it's, uh, it's secured. It's not going anywhere. We're, we've got our leads coming through, uh, this is just one of the knockouts, a drain plug, so we got our motor leads coming through that, and uh, anyway, we're rewiring everything, we'll get to all that taken care of, and we should be able to be driving it uh, tonight. I'm going to clean up the uh, battery posts, and uh, start charging the batteries, and just get that out of the way. Everything's doing okay. Well, I have to say I do like the way our battery box looks. Uh, as soon as we get... My brother's going to pick up the, uh, the rack for the front. And then uh, we'll have uh, this battery box mounted, and uh, that'll pretty much complete our project of sort of painting it and uh, upgrading our motor control. Uh, we have uh, 90 volts for the back. It'll be 30 volts up here for a total of 120 volts, and that's using six volt golf cart batteries. Um, everything seems to be pretty good. Look at that, Tom. I do like the way that box 